glucose has a huge impact on Indian agriculture. Have you ever thought that it has the same amount of impact on Indian agriculture? Don't worry, I have taken care of that for you. Here are the 10 most popular questions from the section of general agriculture, current affairs for all their of subjects. And you end up with the students. Don't forget the relevance of this topic to your examination. Without further delay, let's look at the question. Let me introduce myself. I am Rakshit, pursuing Masters of Agriculture Extension in IAR in New Delhi. Okay, the first question is on your program number screen. What was the climatic process responsible for the present outbreak of locusts? The options are A. El Nino, B. La Nino, C. Indian Ocean Diaper or Indian Nino, D. Drought. Try to answer this. And the answer is Indian Ocean Dipole, also known as Indian Nino. If you are wondering what is Indian Ocean Dipole, I will ask Google for that. Hey Google, what is IOD? Seems like she is sleeping. Let her sleep. I will answer for that. Indian Ocean Dipole is an irregular oscillation of sea surface temperature in which the western Indian Ocean becomes alternatively warmer and colder than the eastern part of the ocean. When western part of the Indian Ocean is warmer than the eastern part, it is called positive dipole and this leads to the rainfall in western part of the Indian Ocean. As the locusts live in this desert region, the rain over this region provided favorable environment to the locust for the breeding. Here is the second question on your full HD screens. Female locusts can lay the eggs dash centimeters below the soil surface. And the options are A. 2 to 5 cm, B. 5 to 10 cm, C. 10 to 15 cm, D. 15 to 20 cm. The answer is B. 5 to 10 seconds. Female locusts can stretch their abdomen to lay eggs deeper into the soil. That's why they can only lay eggs in sandy soils. Let's quickly move into third question. Here is the question on your full HD display. Huge group of adult locusts is called as A. Transient B. Band C. Swarm D. Folk Try to answer this. The answer is swarms. That is huge group of colorized adult locusts is called as swarm. And uh, the same for immatures is called as band. That is huge group of gregorized immatures is called as band. And uh, gregorized locusts are the locusts which behave in groups. And solitary locusts are the locusts which behave individually. Let's move into next question. Okay, here is the next question for you awesome viewers. Scientific name of desert locust is a. Cystocerca gregaria B. Locusta migratoria C. Nomadacris saxinata D. Anacardium species Try to answer this Yes, the scientific name of a desert locust is Cystocerca gregaria If you answered the threat, congratulations And others are Locusta migratoria is a migratory locust And uh, Nomadacris saxinata is a Bombay locust And uh, Anacardium species is a tree locust Here is the fifth question Final molt of locust is called as a. Fledgling B. Splitting C. Exuvation D. Fledging The answer is Fledging. Note the spelling here that is F L E D G I N G. Fledging. And the locust after fledging is called as Fledgling or Immature Adult. Here the spelling is F L E D G L I N G. And the locust immediately after the fledging doesn't mature. The locust mature when there is a favorable environment and interesting thing here is a mature locust will cause others to mature. It is the reason for well synchronized maturation in swarms. By this we have come off with through our questions. This is the great progress for you awesome guys. Keep the same energy with you and let's move on. Here is the sixth question flashing on your right eyes. Swarms fly to migrate during a night. B. Day. C. Both day and night. D. Only evening. 
the answer is day yes the swans migrate during day that is gregarized locust migrate during day and solitary locust migrate during night here is the seventh question specially for ms dhoni fans the organization primarily responsible for locust survey and control operations in india is a locust warning organization b state agriculture department c kvk d locust survey organization The answer is Locust Warning Organization, whose central headquarters is situated at Faridabad, and field headquarters is situated at Jodhpur, where experiments and trials are conducted. Here is the eighth question: The toxicity label color of melatonin is A. Green, B. Blue, C. Yellow, D. Red. The toxicity label color of melatonin is blue, that is moderately toxic. Do you know on what basis the toxicity level is decided? Yes, LD50. If you know what LD50 is, write it in comment section. I have another tricky question for you. What is the target animal for deciding LD50? Is it the organism that we want to control or it is mammal? Please write it in comment section. And here comes the penalty meat question. The chemical in nerve system of locust responsible for gregarization is A. Dopamine. B gamma amino butyric acid C epinephrine D serotonin the answer is yes serotonin the happy chemical the release of serotonin in the nerve system is induced when a locust is touched on hind femur by another locust and this leads to gregarization we have come to the last question of the video recommended control measure for locust is a making loud sound b waving white cloth c creating a cloud of smoke d all of the above the answer is all of the above all of these are most effective when the flying locust or about to descend in large swarm that is just before sunset we can also use the killer fungus metrisium acridium for selective control of locust that is without harming beneficial organisms now you know answers for top 10 questions about locust congratulations for that at last i have a question for you what is the family of locust if you know write it in the comment box at last if you have come this far there is a possibility that you have liked my video please express it by pressing like and subscribing to the channel agritude help me to bring content like this thank you for watching let's meet in the next video in the channel agritude till then bye bye